earliest part you want to marry me, Miss Belinda? Yes, Lord Mayor. Then prove yourself worthy. Travel around the world in 80 days. Impossible! We shall do it. And bet your 20,000 pounds you can't hit the bed. Around the world in 80 days. Pop, pop, doo. So far, we marry Belinda Mays. Pop, pop, doo. It's come down. Yes, no lies. At your service. Stop Bob from traveling around the world in 80 days. I must win that bet. Bob may fail because of fix. And then Bob mixes his the trick. Around the world with... Oh, Phileas, do be careful. My uncle is sending this man named Six to stop you. Don't you worry, mademoiselle. Ah, as his companion shall watch out for Monsieur Pete. Around the world in 80 days, so folks, they're very blind amazed. Around the world with... Bop, bop, boo! 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 Bop, b
for long sea voyage. He will be lost for days in the Greek islands. Your job, make sure Fogg arrives at the Tranto waterfront by five o'clock. My boys will do the rest. Well, that's simple, Mr. Fix. Nothing to it, Mr. Fix. When Fogg arrives in town, I'll just work out one of my clever plans to get him down to the waterfront. Easy. Aren't you forgetting something, Mr. Fix? What's that, Mr. Fix? You locked up Fogg in the mountains, Mr. Fix. And a very good job I did, too. He'll never get to a tranta. Never get to a tranta! You dumb dumb! Got to get him back! Got to get him back! Got to get him back! But nothing is happening with you, and it is getting late. I'm worried, and Toto is worried. Termites work slowly, Pat Patu, but they work surely. Yeah! Go, go, go! Get your get! But I do not see anything, monsieur. Termites work from the inside. They hollow out the wood, and pretty soon it's just like paper. They can turn a whole building into sawdust. Almost there, Mr. Fix. What are you going to tell them, Mr. Fix? Better to disguise yourself, Mr. Fix. As what, Mr. Fix? How about a travel agent, Mr. Fix? Brilliant, Mr. Fix. Sounds hollow to me, Pastor too. We should be out of here in no time. Now I'm here. Uh, oh, uh, Algernon Cookie at your service. Cookie's my name and Trevor's my game. Understand you want to get to a tranto. Nothing simpler. <laughs> but how did you know? Quiet, Toto. Behave, you naughty monkey. I'm the world's greatest travel agent. Here today, gone tomorrow is my motto. In you go. No time to lose. No time to lose. Off we go. Yes. <laughs> We're supposed to know which one is Fogg. Lord May said Fogg will be wearing a tall hat. As soon as we see him, we grab him, toss him into a sack, pop on board and sail away. How long we supposed to be at sea? Lord May said to sail around at least 80 days. Fire food! Your hat, it is ruined! No matter, I think I uh, can repair it when we get aboard the ship. He should be here by now. Look! Must be Fog. See the tall hat. But they look so stupid. <laughs> here we are, gents. Right at the waterfront. Cookies, travel service, got you any time. Right this way, if you please. You've done a good job. How much do we owe? I say, where did he go? Parlez-vous! He has disappeared! Well, no time to look. And that's our boat over there, and we're just going to make it. Ah! Ah, Mr. Fogg, I thought we were going to have to sail without you. Had a little delay, but now we can get underway for Greece. You dumb dumbs! Let me out of here! You've got the wrong man! Let me out, I say! Oh, that's better! Now, see, you've made a terrible mistake. I'm not Fog, I'm Fix. <laughs> that's what they all say. Lord May says to grab a gent in a tall hat, and that's you. But you don't understand. That was a disguise. Oh, 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 oh. A disguise, is it? Mighty suspicious, Mr. Fogg. Disguise, is it? Mighty suspicious. I'm not Fog, I'm Fix. Fix is after Fog, so as Fix, I'll disguise myself to fool Fog. So Fix can fix. Fog and da-da! What's the use? Oh, a likely story. I don't think you know who you are. I'm Fix! 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 I work for Lord May too! Prove it. Says <laughs> prove it, Mr. Fix. How are you going to do that, Mr. Fix? Show him your credentials, Mr. Fix. 
what credentials, Mr. Fix? Hmm. How about the telegram, Mr. Fix? From Lord Mays, Mr. Fix. Exactly, Mr. Fix. Brilliant, Mr. Fix. I thought so. Here, look at this. Now do you understand? I was just carrying out my orders bringing fog to you when you dummies grabbed the wrong man. Now, what will we do? Well, if we don't do something fast, Fogg will make his connections in Greece and Lord Mays will be very, very, very mad. Do you have a plan? Do I have a plan? Do I have a plan? Well, now that you mention it, no. First, we've got to find Fogg. But where is he? Somewhere out there, on the good ship Argo. The Ionian Sea Pass Bantu. One of the most beautiful and historic bodies of water on the face of the earth. Historic, monsieur? Why, do you know that thousands of years ago, the ancient Greeks sailed over this very water, exploring for new lands? And later, the ancient Romans sailed across here to conquer Greece. And up ahead is the island of Ithaca, where Ulysses was king. Whole armies have sailed across here, past too. It is so peaceful out here now. No big tricks to worry about either. Look, there is another boat. Hmm. It seems to be trying to catch us. Parlez-vous! They are shooting at us! Well, Captain, what are you going to do? Captain? Captain! Where are you going? Nonsense. Starting your chances before you've done may cost you the race you might have won. We'll sail the ship ourselves. But I do not know how to sail, monsieur. The book, lad. You can learn as you go along. I'll take the helm. You and Toto handle the sails. to unlock these chains. But I do not have the bag. Over there. They brought the bag with me, but they put it out of my reach. But what now? I must get back or they will come for me. No, lad. We're going for a swim. Follow me. 
Parlez-vous à swim out in all this water? According to my calculations, we're just a short distance from a small island. And how are we to get there from this boat, monsieur? Swim, Patmatu. Quickly now. We can never swim so far, and there is probably no island there at all. And think of the sharks, monsieur. Oh, there is no chance for us. Doubting your chances before you're done may cost you the race you might have won. We'll be that back for two. Or won't we desert? A fawn cabin boy he makes. Cabin boy, where are you, cabin boy? More than likely asleep, that one. Or sitting in his stomach. They're gone! The fog and Pasquatu are gone! They've run away, you fools! Fog has got free of his chains and they've disappeared! Probably got over the side, I guess. Help for swim to the bottom of the sea, most likely. They won't be making it to land from out here. But we have to try and find them! Why? Just so long as they don't get to Greece, who cares where they are? And believe me, they won't get any place from out here. Oh. <laughs> but there's a job to be done. I have to go after them, I tell you. Oh, did you hear that now? Mr. Fix has got to go after those two. Well, now I think we can oblige. No, stop! It is good to feel land again. This is the small island I told you about. But we are still far away from Greece, are we not? How shall we ever manage to make our train? There is still time, Fatbatu, but we must hurry. Give me the timetable from the bag. Just as I thought. In a short while, a steamer will be just a few miles from here, headed for the coast of Greece. A few miles? Parlez-vous! What good will that be to us? We cannot swim a few miles. But we can get aboard, lad. Come along and do as I tell you. <laughs> oh, I'm not alone. There he is at it again. Fog never knows when he's fixed. I'll just sneak up and see what he's up to. Parlez-vous! How is it possible for such a thing to work, monsieur? Same principle as a slingshot, Fafatu. By bending down these trees to precisely the right angle, we fix them so that they will fling whatever is aboard to our destination. You mean we shall be aboard that? Precisely. But how? Who would release the trees? We cannot be up there and down here at the same time. It will never, never work, Monsieur Fogg. Doubting your chances before you're done may cost you the race you might have won. The candle, Paspatu. The candle? But it is not yet dark. We shall use the candle to release the rope. See here. When we are ready, we simply light this candle, which will burn through the rope, which will release the bent trees, which will fling us through the air to land at our destination. So, that's their plan, is it, Mr. Fix? And what can you do about it, Mr. Fix? Well, if they're planning to fling themselves into Greece, why can't I do the same? Right co, Mr. Fix. Only you can fling yourself first, Mr. Fix, then get there ahead of those two. Good idea, Mr. Fix. That way I can have a little surprise party ready when they land. Then hurry along, Mr. Fix. <coughs> Steady, Papa, too. We'll be sailing through the air any moment now to land aboard that steamship. It requires split-second timing, or we might miss and land in the water. Parlez-vous! I hope you have split the seconds in just the right way, monsieur. He does not know we are aimed for a steamship. <laughs> Look at them, 
get along behind. And when I get to Greece first, I'll prepare me a little surprise party for them man. There is a steamship up ahead! Right on schedule. What's wrong? I'm stuck in down. But we haven't reached land yet. What's happening? Down! <laughs> Would you care for a spot of tea, gentlemen, before we land in Greece? Good show. Tea time exactly. Oh, Monsieur Fogg, this time I have learned my lesson well. Doubting your chances before you're done may cost you the race you might have won. <laughs> <laughs> On the other hand, if you're overconfident, you might miss the boat. Good show, Fat Batu. Around the world in 80 days, pass the two, so Fog may marry Brinda Mace. Pass the two, Fog may fail because of fix, and then Fog nicks his fixes his tricks. Around the world with pass the two. Around the world in 80 days, so Fog may marry Brinda Mace. Around the world with 